yeah, yeah, there was a very good reason. Uh, when we did it, we shot this in 79 where Tom Skerritt's found. Mm -hmm. And it's, it shows you how hard it, it is to reach a creative decision. We filmed it and it was spectacular and it cost a lot. And we actually demolished the set with a flamethrower. But a strange thing happened when we ran it for ourselves. We found that the, the climax wasn't working because Sigourney couldn't just automatically know where Tom Skerritt was. So it took nine extra minutes to justify we believe she could find him, and that totally undid the rest of the end of the movie. The audience was saying, come on, get off the ship, come on, get off the ship. And it hurt like crazy, the end. You have to have perfect pitch. And when we took out that scene, the whole thing worked great and nobody missed it. And so the only reason we later put it in was we had the luxury 25 years later and everybody knew and was fans of the movie by then, so we could do it. So that's pretty much uh, why well, we did it. But it was great, you know, it's good that we all came to the same conclusion because we could have made a terrible mistake. Wouldn't that have been tragic? Because the thing was working great. And by being, uh, uh, by being uh, your ego in a way, saying, oh, look at that great idea we had where he says, kill me, and he's growing the egg again. You have to be able to, like, cutting off a little finger, no matter how good some scene or scenes are. If it hurts the overall movie, you have to have the willpower to take it out. I think that's a lesson. That's our biggest danger as filmmakers. We tend to get indulgent. I mean, it's hard to be objective. I'm interested in your perspective on this as a franchise. This is amazingly, they're still making movies about this creature, and yeah. even within the past couple yeah, of years. Yeah, well, three, I was really thrilled that I think it was 2003 or four. the alien egg prop was admitted to the Smithsonian Institute. Mm -hmm. that when we thought, thought, thought of this movie, I'm sure, whatever my optimism was, I didn't think I'd end up in the Smithsonian. Yeah. I also want to thank uh, the audience. Uh, it was really a pleasure to watch this movie with uh, an audience that wasn't, you know, trying to text message. Uh, <laughs> into the movie. And it's great to see so many people uh, that never movies. saw it. Yeah. It's especially gratifying for me to see a generation of people that a lot of them never even seen the movie or not seen it on a big screen. Thanks very much.